Now, what was there some of the, the reasoning behind such heavy incorporation of Facebook rather than making it a separate app like other, you know, phones out there have? Well, thematically, really one of the things that we've tried to do in the new design of Windows 7 series phones is simplify it by bringing together all this complexity of stuff that's out there on the internet. Yeah. If you think about the way people use PCs, and, and truthfully the way a lot of smartphone UIs have evolved, um, it's about separate apps. You've got your browser, it's a thing you live in. You've got a website, it's a thing you live right, in. Right, and you have to close one to exactly. open another. It's, exactly. it's cumbersome. So what we tried to do was pick the top tasks, so people, photos, yeah. music and video, and create in each of those a hub which pulls in interesting stuff on the web, third-party applications, the mm -hmm. content on your device, and the actions of people that you care about so that you have a one-stop shop. It makes it simpler for people. Um, you know, if I'm going to deal with photos on my PC, it doesn't bother me so much to switch between apps. Mm -hmm. But on a phone with a small screen, we want you to have one place that you can go and see all those things brought together. And that's why we focused a lot on integrating social networks. We work yeah. closely with Facebook and with Windows Live. And so you get not just those two, but also all of the social networks that connect to Windows Live. And that's quite a few. Very Twitter, cool. Flickr, all those things work sort of natively in the phone. And by the way, there's lots of great functionality that can be added in third-party applications too. I'm sure, But yeah. we wanted a really natural way for people to do those things by default. Well, I'm happy that you did. Now, I know you're not quite ready to show it yet, but can you speak to the gaming experience? Because there is Xbox yeah, Live Yeah, absolutely. Um, we're going to talk more about the exact specifics of all the third-party applications at Mix. That's so, right. So, so stay tuned. Register for Mix March um, 15th through 17th. Uh, uh, but what we are doing is we're building in a games hub, and the games hub will feature Xbox Live. It'll have other third-party games as well, but uh, it's going to focus on Xbox Live and letting the phone create for you a great social gaming experience. So you can connect with your friends and play games with them interactively, not awesome. just on the phone device, but on other devices too, the PC and so on. Um, and also let you sort of boost your standing within the Xbox Live community, earn gamer score, right. um, earn achievements, all those sorts of things. Very important. Well, thank you very much. This is very exciting. Uh, and as we just said, you guys want to sign up and register for Mix. And stay tuned to Channel 9 because we're going to be covering, uh, we're going to have a ton of videos covering Windows Phone and uh, hopefully all the way up until you get them in your hands, of your very own. Thank you, Joe. Thank you very much. Thanks very much.